Hi guys, starting with this week, I'm launching the weekly homework. So every week, I'll give you a certain targets you have to complete. With the promise that within three months, we'll complete the full syllabus for CAD, SNAP, and MET, almost all the exams. Yep. So every week, if you can just give me two hours every day or work on the weekend, whichever way it works for you. So you have to complete these five topics. Whatever you're doing, you can do on your own. Like you should spend eight hours every day studying, ten hours every day. Great. Continue with that. But just add these four or five topics every week into the timetable. So those who are joining CET, those who already joined us or those who want to join us the online program, this timetable will work for you as well. Fine. So first topic which I want to pick up is grammar. And within grammar, if you can focus on prepositions because preposition is one of the main area. Now grammar is not coming in the CAT exam per se, but it is going to come in every other exam. Like one week before CAT, we have got one week or two weeks before CAT, we got NMAT and you will find grammar there. One week after CAT is IFT, my cat snap, you'll find grammar everywhere. So grammar is something you can't ignore. Yeah, it won't be coming in CAT, but it will be coming in every other exams. That till CET exam. So grammar preposition, the first topic you want to do. Second topic which you pick up, pick up is close test. Close test is kind of in the blanks, which is again not coming in CAT, but is very important for the basics. So close test, if you can complete, that can be another good help you can do. It will be coming in CET for five marks, NMAT, SNAP, almost every other exam apart from cat cat so it's kind of a close test is kind of uh, i'm gonna fill the blanks yeah so close test and number uh, grammar close test then move to logic section i want you to do uh, start, start, start the puzzles now puzzles is called problem solving in theory taking yellow books if you can do that chapter cat 16 questions of puzzles CET was shocker last year with 51 question of puzzles out of 200 mark paper 50 mark paper was based on puzzle. So puzzle is something which you can easily pick up in the, the, this week. So problem solving in C taking book, I think chapter number 16 or 7 in logic section. Next topic which I want to pick up is statement assumptions. Statement assumption is going to come for one to two marks in every exam. It is not coming to care for last two years, but two years critical reasoning is something which you have to pick up along with this thing. And from the quant point of view, I want to pick up Mensuration. Mensuration is a huge topic. Trust me. You can spend weeks on that. If not one week, you can spend weeks on that. So if you can cover up that part, it will be of a, will compromise, it will sum, summarize most of the topics. Mensuration is more about formula. You have to cover up formula for everything. But main two topics is areas and volume which you need to cover up. So if you can go through all the formulas of triangle, circles, rectangle, all those things and volumes, total surface area, little surface area. So you can expect more, in fact, the menstruation is more important than geometry. So in the CAT paper, if I talk about geometry and menstruation together, there are seven questions. So out of seven questions, find four or five questions based on menstruation and two or three questions based on geometry. So menstruation is more important than geometry. Okay. So that's all we need to cover up today. So uh, grammar, uh, prepositions, closed test, puzzles, which is problem solving, uh, statement, assumptions, and Menstruation. So if you can cover up all these five topics, we are covering almost 10 to 15, 20 marks of CET paper, if not more, because of the puzzles, and at least 8 to 10 marks of the CAT paper as well. Alright, so all the best. Thank you.